<laughs> good morning, everybody. Wow, is that too loud? Are we good to go? Right. Afternoon. Afternoon. Hello. It was colder in the morning. I was trying to get you brain right, okay? Get the right mental attitude. And everything. So, my name is Charles Lee. I'm a lieutenant with the North Carolina State Highway Patrol. And we are here with Key Fitness today to do the first annual parking lot polar punch here in Roanoke Rapids. <laughs> Thank you all so much for coming out, showing support for these plungers who are freezing for a reason and plunging for a cause. Yeah. Now, all of you all jumping? No. We've got plenty of water. You can go inside. No? Okay. So, before we go any further, I want to uh, introduce uh, the person that is responsible for this. Uh, this is Miss Autumn Moore. Keep fitness. That's right. There's a little fan club back there in the back. <laughs> Come on up here, Autumn. <laughs> I was just tickled pink when uh, Doc Kolbach from uh, Special Olympics headquarters called me uh, several months ago and said, Hey, we want to do a polling punch uh, in Roanoke Rapids. I'm going, Where? <laughs> <laughs> No, I know where Rona crap it is, even though I grew up in Durham and I'm stationed in Raleigh. Uh, but she was telling about Autumn, and Autumn has participated in several, how I many would you say, Autumn? About 10. About 10 polar plunges back home in Virginia Beach. Yeah, it just must have been uh, karma there, because that's where I was born at and lived for my first 10 years north of Virginia Beach. So we just made this uh, connection back together. And so, but Autumn is here in Rona Graphics now, working at Key Fitness. And say, come up with a great idea. She wants to do one here for the community. And so I'm going to turn it over to her, and I think that's just a wonderful thing. I just wanted to say thank you to everybody for coming out and to all the plungers. And I know it's crazy and I know it's cold, but thank you very much. <laughs> Ow! Woo! Yeah. Woo! Woo! <laughs> well, that's exactly right. I was actually at a graduation ceremony at the academy yesterday, and somebody said there was the three keys to public speaking from uh, President Roosevelt. Be sincere, be short, be back in your seat. <laughs> Autumn fits that bill perfectly. <laughs> Next person I'd like to introduce is going to be our very first plunger this morning, Miss Charlotte Webb. Come on up here, Charlotte. This is an honor, you know. <laughs> Charlotte Webb Smith. Charlotte flew in from New Orleans last night. Okay. Charlotte is our top fundraiser. I know on her website she had over $1,600 as of this morning. And so and just to give you a little background, the, the event today, we definitely are over $3,000. So that's super. And we've had several plungers show up and register and, and turn in some other donations that were not. So we're pretty confident that we're going to definitely be over thirty-five, if not close to $4,000, which is just a wonderful thing. But Charlotte's going to be our very first jumper this morning. You see the outfit here. We go, we got the shark. Anything particular about the shark, Charlotte? Jimmy Buffett fins up. Jimmy Buffett fins up. That's exactly right. But before we let Charlotte jump in, I want to also give a hand out to Mr. Gary Wright. He's with the Lake Gaston Lions Club. We're just jumping in for a few seconds and getting right out. Gary's going to be hanging out here for the duration. You're not supposed to tell them that. The pool's not heated. Don't tell them the pool's not heated. We lied to them. So, it's refreshing. This is the second one that I have, will have been done this year. My daughter's going to jump with me last at the very end. And we jumped in Lake Norman earlier this year in February for Special Olympics. So it's just a wonderful cause. Well, without further ado, you ready, Charlotte? Do I have to push you in? This is like... No, this is I, like I can clear house. parachuting. I'm not able to push you. You have to jump. It's on your own. You ready? Give me a countdown. Give me a countdown. Five, four, three, two, one, go! Rebecca, 
This is Rebecca from Key Fitness here. And I asked her what was interesting. Why was she jumping? Her physical therapy patients are getting back at her. They provided all the donations if she would jump. You ready? You gonna jump a second time? Just once? You gotta do everything in life just once. You ready? Let's go. One, two, three. She's acting, she's acting, it's all play. Can't you see the steam rising up out of the water? Our pool is provided by Special Olympics North Carolina, and of course the fire department here from Roanoke Rapids was gracious enough to bring out our water this morning. Keep saying a prayer for us, because as they set it up yesterday and then started putting the water in this morning, we found out we had two small leaks. So we're creeping our fingers crossed that it doesn't collapse by the end. Who's next? Mendes! 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 Go for it! This is Mendes from Key Fitness. He's a fitness specialist here. Uh, he's doing this, he said, because his girlfriend. Uh, her brother is a special needs uh, child here, and so he's all about supporting his girlfriend and family and everything. <laughs> There's no apprehensiveness here. I can't push you, man, Dave. You got to go. You're going to give us the cannonball demonstration, aren't you? <laughs> Belly flop, oh, 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 believe it when I see it, but be careful. Are you ready, Bruce? Yeah, Bruce! Bruce is eight years old? Eight years old. Eighty years old. This is Bruce Perizzo? Perizzo. My body. This is Bruce Perizzo. He is a bear. I'm getting up in my ears. My hearing is going. Bruce said he wanted to come out and show you what happens when you get cold water and y'all shrivel up and everything. I asked him, why are you jumping in the water? You're already there. He's going to sit down because he has a bad hip. But Bruce is a former volunteer farmer from New York. He's with the Lake Gaston County Alliance Club. Way to go! We're standing over there and are not doing this. I've got kids doing this. I've got an 80 year old man doing this. They can't say it, but I'm challenging you if not. Next year. Next year. Who's next? Who's behind you there, Autumn? Brian Campbell. Brian Campbell. Come on up here, Brian. <laughs> so, Brian would chant Challenger, Challenger, middle school. And the band teacher, correct?